So if he if he does in fact hit off of Clemens. So Roger told me this morning he said yeah I'm going to pitch to Charles but I am not going to pitch to Albert Pujols because Albert Pujols <laughs> knows what he's doing to that point. Pujols hit 308 in his career against the Rocket. I saw Roger on the range this morning. I said in your day when you were bringing the heat he said about 97 98 miles per hour. I said okay yesterday you were so Larry the cable I guy today Chuck, Roger. I, get over here Smiley get in here. So I told Chuck it's going to sound like bacon in a frying pan and Chuck said I like bacon. <laughs> the other guy's going to get in there. I was enjoying my round of golf, but it's going to be a nightmare if Albert gets in. <laughs> so Roger said now that heater's about 70 compared to 97, 98 back in the day. Well, you know, at age 60 last year in Philadelphia, yeah. he pitched batting practice. You know the Savannah Bananas on that old tour? Oh, boy. He pitched there. He said he got it up to 85 recently. Here we go. Come on, Pujols. <laughs> the main event is here, Steve. Here we go. Walk I see the intentional walks. There you go. Uh, Smiley, come on now. Let's see it. Oh, uh, get out of here. Roger Clemens doesn't back down from anybody. It should be worth noting that although Pujols hit 308 against the Rocket, not one single home run. I've stood in against Roger Clemens back in the day at the AT&T. You tear your right ACL? Now. It's it's terrifying <laughs> when he's in there bringing the heater. All right, Roger, let's call Charles a shot. Hey, I'll tell you what. He's he's been practicing or something, man. I'm telling you. He's hit some golf shots today and both him and Albert have come out of bunkers like they know what they're, like they know what they're doing. <laughs> What's impressed you the most about his game now compared to maybe when you used to play with him? It's just the consistency of his swing. Watch this right here. I mean, it's so much better. Hopefully, he hits a good one. No, no, I jinxed him. I jinxed him. That's my fault, Chuck. We're not going to say what that one was. He's used a few words that, you know, I told him, you know why they call it golf, because all the other four letter words are taken, but he's actually used a few of those. <laughs> and today, he said he's been struggling a little bit with the swing, and we know how golf goes. It's hard to make that a swing adjustment hey, on the fly. With us. Look at this. We're, we feel like big leaguers. Get over here, Case. It's my son, Casey. He's got it. What's going on? The wrong club. Well, guys, thank you for coming out. Go uh, kit it up and down. Okay, I'll chuck one. There we go. Having a good time, guys.